Look who's home. I am back. It's Devin. We're back and we're unwrapping the race car today because this car needs to go to Abraham and in order for it to do that, he needs all the wrap off. All right. Well, we're gonna start our morning by unwrapping the race car. All right, look at this progress by Devin. This car used to be wide bodied, as you can tell, so it's going. Uh, now it's 70% Bondo. It's 70% Bondo, so we're putting on the Origin Lab over fenders that were on Alyssa's car. We're gonna mold it to the car, it should look really nice. Um, this was my progress. Not much. You got any blisters yet? Nope. I don't know how you don't have any blisters. I just removed a little piece here and I almost got a blister. Sign. Sign here. Oh, uh, oh yeah. Big old sharpie. Whoever buys this car gets a nice treat. Vandalism. No. Bro, what the heck? So stupid. I'm gonna have to sand all this off now. It's another day. Ghost. Day three, and uh, Devin's still unwrapping the race car, so. Oh. No. No. The roof is the only thing left. Yeah. And the door. Look at that. Race car is like all red now. Almost all red. It's got a blue door still. Some of the roof. Hi right, everyone, this is Christian. Yeah. Right? Yep. And you got a, uh, he had an Integra. Yeah. But uh, now he's got a Civic Si. He's here to get a chrome delete done. So while we have the race car out, we might as well le uh, stretch its legs a little bit. Here's some AC. Race car with AC. There, you can hold it right there. I got you. You can aim at yourself too. I got you. It runs so rough with the AC though. Yeah, it sounds like it. Yeah, like, like Devin was telling you, the rev limiter is at 6,000. It doesn't even let you get into it. Alright boys, car is officially uh, mainly unwrapped now, so uh, we're all done with our end of the deal here. So now we have to take the car to Abraham, as I've been mentioning multiple times in the video. Abraham is going to be repairing the whole body kit and the body, and he's going to be molding some quarter panel over fenders on the car. So we can go ahead and cover up all this ugliness here, so um, it's, it's actually going to be... It's actually gonna be really nice when we're done with it. The body kit's gonna be all touched up and filled, and then the car is gonna be smooth for us to wrap, quarter panel, all this ugliness will be covered, and um, and then we go to wrap. So this is this is really exciting, and, and it's really cool because we get to build this car still and sell it after. Something that might be even cooler is that we might have a potential buyer for this car already, and he's in Risen. So uh, he's part of Risen, Kansas, and um, We'll see. If he ends up buying it, that'd be really cool. If not, it's all good. We can find somebody else that will buy it and keep the build alive. But if this car goes to somebody in the family, even better. So I'm excited. And it'll be able to represent Risen out in Kansas. I think that's just such a cool thing. And we already have the wrap color picked out for this car. Um, it's an emerald green roll that we've had leftover stock in. Um, I would have liked to ask whoever's going to buy this car what color they want to wrap it and wrap it. Um, but we already have a color that we're just going to put on the car. Uh, most likely so then kind of from here we just have to drop this car off to Abraham and then we are going to be finishing the build from there with the coilovers the headlights the taillights and the wrap and uh, that should just be super cool um, but I did want to talk to you guys 
about something really quick the videos the daily videos the daily streak i'm sure a lot of you guys have noticed that i didn't post tuesday wednesday and possibly thursday of last week for you guys and uh that's simply because the wrap shop's been getting busy i have to focus on the wrap shop um, I do want a daily vlog, but I tried to daily vlog and it ended up just being a lot of footage of work, which was a disassembly of the Supra, uh, Chrome Delete, Tint, a bunch of other stuff, and that wasn't stuff that was entertaining for the channel. And I know I want to show you guys my daily activities, but at the same time, I don't want to make videos that are boring to you guys and it just becomes a waste of my time to edit. I'd rather work on videos that you guys are going to watch, that you guys like. Um, so with this car, for example, it took about three days to unwrap for Devin. Um, he's just working on it slowly. It's not like it was a three day job. It's just we weren't really focusing on this car because we had other projects to work on. Um, so I wasn't able to make a video every day since this became like a three day thing between all the work we have at the shop. But um, I will say I am not giving up on the vlog streak. Vlog streak basically means I'm gonna vlog 100 vlogs straight. This is, uh, I, I think we're on vlog 10 maybe now. We will be back on the daily vlogs here soon because this week we've been trying to focus on the shop. Once we get this car back from Abraham, we're just gonna go ahead and throw the coilovers and the headlights, taillights wrap on and it'll be done. And then as for the 22 BRZ, the next video should be putting a duck bill on and then we just ordered a bunch of brake stuff. We got new tires, we're gonna get the wheels refinished and then we have Gatlinburg coming up and we also have a tune and a turbo kit on the way. That might be the plan with that, um, but definitely we're doing brakes because I ordered rotors, pads, steelers, brake lines. Then we're probably gonna get the calipers powder coated and all that. So there's a lot of content coming for the 22 and uh, and we're also, you know, wrapping things up with this car. So it's getting, it's getting pretty hectic right now. Um, wrap shop's been getting busy again, which is really good and uh, yeah, I'm just letting you guys know if there's not a vlog, there's just simply wasn't enough things I could do in my day to be entertaining for you guys. There was me focusing on work um, instead of being able to focus on the channel, and I'm sorry. So, so yeah, that's why you guys will miss some daily uploads. And I know it's like, it's not called a streak if it's not every day, but I'm already going Monday through Thursday. Um, just to remind you guys, I don't post Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I need those weekends to myself. I'm, I'm sorry for missing some uploads, uh, but it's better me doing it this way than making content that you guys don't want to watch and burning out. That's kind of how I see it. Um, but I promise you guys, I know you guys love the consistent vlogs. I know you guys are so good at following along, so I'm going to stick to it uh, here shortly. We're going to get back on it. And um, some weeks you're just going to see me gun out vlogs, and some weeks you're not. Those are the weeks that I'm busy at the shop. And then the weeks that it slows down or I am able to do some stuff to myself, then I, I will be focusing on the channel. So kind of trying to find that balance between everything is interesting, um, but it's not impossible. That's all I have for you guys today. I'm glad the race car is unwrapped. Um, I just gave you guys a full roadmap of what's coming next, so I hope you guys are ready. But thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to never stop dreaming.